Hello, Peter. Hey, I've been waiting all day for this. Yeah, me too. Good. So, do you want to start or uh... start? Oh, yeah. Right. Sure. Start. Uh, sure. Okay. Cool. Yeah, so, yeah. how about I slip into my Batman tights and you put on your Catwoman ears and we do some purring? Yeah, sounds great. So, so are you up for this or? Um, sorry, Peter. I don't know. Um, maybe we can just talk first. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Talk. Yeah. I think where you're coming from. You know, mix it up a bit because. You know, I have been a very naughty superhero. Not that kind of talk. Look, forget it. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have brought it up. Oh, so you actually want to like talk talk? Yeah. Okay, but... I suppose. Uh, so what's on your mind? No, I mean, forget it. Like, it's not that we know each other that well anyway. Yeah, agreed. And it's always better to not know the people you have sex with. Can I... Um trust you peter depends on what you tell me oh. what if i told you that i wanted you i'd say give me a second to slip into my tights and uh, no, 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 no. forget the tights for a second and focus i mean i want you oh okay all right yeah okay i know what you mean Look, um, it, it's no offence, but I do think it's a little bit too soon to be asking for my sperm. I don't want your sperm, Peter. Oh, okay, cool. That's a relief. I mean, don't get me wrong. I got sperm, baby. I got lots of it. <laughs> I have so much sperm, I don't even know what to do with it. Yeah, I'm sure you do. You damn right, I do. As a matter of fact, I've got a freezer full of it. Full of what? Sperm. That is disgusting. And thank you for that disturbing visual. I know I regret asking this, but why do you have sperm in your freezer? Well, between you and me, I have stacks of tube stocks in there just waiting for the right girl to come along and suck it up. <laughs> hey, you didn't just happen to have your period, did you? What? No, I didn't have my period. And what does that have to do with anything? I think it's just, just so you know, though, even though it's cyber, it's still kind of a really big turn off. So look, I'm on this golf online league thing. And I'm just hoping to rub one off before tea time. So if we could just like get it going here. You do realize I'm a human being with needs. Hmm? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, baby. Let me take care of those needs. No, no, no. I take care of my own needs. Yeah, but not without the dark night. Oh, yeah, because a grown man with blue mask and tights puts me over the edge every time. Do you have a problem with Batman? Peter, you do realize that cyber sex isn't sex, right? Sure feels like right sex to me. Talking about real sex, Peter. Not like sitting in front of the computer moaning like an idiot. Don't you remember what it's what it feels like being with a woman? Yes, I do, and it was wonderful. I mean, no, no, I don't. It's not allowed anymore anyway, it's forbidden. Doesn't that make you feel sad? Whenever I think about never being intimate with someone again, makes me want to cry. Never touching someone ever, ever again. I never think about it. Are you sure about that? What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Do you even know what's happening out there? No, we've been told it is not our concern. And you're okay living your life like a caged animal just because someone told you to do so. Did you, don't you miss feeling the sunlight on your face? Have a sun lamp? Oh yeah, because I heard that the orange look is trying to make a comeback. Hey, look, I'd rather be orange than dead, all right? Besides, we don't have much of a choice. There's always a choice, Peter. We're only led to believe that there isn't one. You're not suggesting. Yes, Peter. Yes, that's exactly what I am suggesting. No, but we can't. Yes, we can. I won't. You will. I'm crazy. For you. I'm hanging up. No, no, you can't. You can't disconnect me. I know you want me, Peter. 
What are you so afraid of? Hmm? A strong, handsome man like you. I, I never said I was afraid, all right? But breaking social distancing is something we shouldn't even be thinking about, let alone talking about. Did you hear that? I have no idea what she is talking about. Oh, yes, you do. You do know what I'm talking about. I can see it in your eyes. No, no, they're just a little bloodshot from a bowl I smoked earlier. Oh, see, you are a little rebel then. No, no, a rebel, no, not true, not true. What is freedom anyway? I don't even know. I'm not even sure if it's a word anymore. Aren't you tired of being a puppet, Peter? That's it. I'm reporting you to the authorities. <laughs> and what are you going to say? Huh? I don't know. All right, the rules change so often I can't even keep up with them. But I'm sure they would like to know what you're trying to do here. All right, maybe I'll even get a reward. Is there a reward out for you, Laura? I bet there is. How many flies do you have inside your web? Oh, Peter, you make me feel so powerful, so wicked. It's, it's kind of starting to turn me on, actually. I think that ship has sunk for me. Oh, really? That's a shame. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be mean to it. Tell me, how can I get your sail up again, huh? Maybe just a, a little tug? All right, all right, stop it. Okay, I know what you're trying to do to me, and it's not going to work. Oh, all right. What, Peter? What were you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about, all right? You think I won't call it on you if you uh... were... I'm, I'm sorry, Peter. I didn't mean to interrupt. You were saying? No, no, just, just stop, just stop it. <sighs> Peter, please, think back to things where... Think about before the virus, before we lost ourselves. No, 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 we've been told not to dwell on what was. Things must always continue or as is, or there will be nothing. I don't care anymore. This is a living, it's existing. I don't know what you want from me, Laura. Uh, uh, what I want, I want you to hold your hand. I want to smell your cologne. I want to feel your hot breath. And I want to hear you moan as you make love to me. I want you inside of me, Peter. No, no, we can't do that. It uh, is, uh, it is uh, oh, come on, Peter. Let's leave again. I'll even take all the chances and come to you. No, 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 no. It, it, it's too risky. I can't get caught again. You don't know what they'll do to me. Again? <laughs> I knew it. I knew I got the right man. Tell me, Peter. Tell me where you want me. Tell me where you live. This isn't fair. Perhaps death will be fair on you. But... I wouldn't be so sure about it. Wouldn't count on it. Wouldn't you just love to touch me? No. No? Yes. How much? So much it hurts. Then stop torturing yourself, Peter. And just give me your address. What are you, the devil? I can be anything you want me to be. God help me. You will need it. Just, uh, just promise me we won't get caught. I promise. I will be just right in and right out. Okay, all right. I, I, I can't believe I'm doing this. Okay, but my address is 110 Caton Avenue. Do you know where that is? Don't worry. I'll find it. Oh, 
I'm sorry, darling. I had another call coming in. I'm just going to mute you for a second, okay? Just one moment. Lieutenant, are you in the position to move in? Just give me the word, Captain. The word. Are you still there, lover? I'm not going anywhere, baby. Oh, I wouldn't be so sure about it. <sighs> Don't shoot! Don't move. <laughs> What the hell is going on here? I haven't done anything. Laura, Laura, tell them how loyal I am. Peter Bailey, you have been disconnected for breaking the social distancing law. You, you can't do this. This is entrapment. Entrapment? <laughs> What's that? Huh? It's weak-minded folks like you that are causing this virus to continue and spread. You make me sick. <sighs> Take him away. Get off me. Don't you touch my sperm. Yeah. Wow. Hello, Susie. Uh, I've been been waiting for this all day. Yeah, me too. But uh, maybe you can just uh, talk first. Hmm? 